Welcome everyone. Blight Nation. What is good with everyone? Ian Vito and Silent Liz. Come on. Hola. At you. <laughs> I'm breaking the silence today. But uh we got Grizzy Hendrix. We got the Eminem disc by Grizzy. Now I know this has been out for a week or so yeah. since the recording. This is the real Black Slim I have not listened to it yet. <laughs> Me, no, I haven't listened to this. Nah. Now, yes, he's dissing our favorite artist here. One of our favorite independent artists is dissing our favorite artist of all time. Yeah, yeah. So this, this should be now, interesting. People have said this is a clout chase. That he's just using Eminem to build himself up. And Grizzy is a self-proclaimed Eminem fan. Yeah. I mean, you're talking about the guy that wrote Where Shady. Yeah. Which, awesome song, by the way. Dude, go check out that. That was an awesome no, song. No, for real, for real. What is what? Bella in the background doing some weird shit? Bella. Bella, you sniffing, baby. Oh, ain't, ain't, ain't nothing over there for you. Yeah. I love his <laughs> art, too, because usually when... It, which is throwing me off a little, too. Because usually when Grizzy <laughs> goes at people, they're the clown. Yeah, there's no clown. Everybody's got a clown. But I'm... Including yeah. Grizzy. Grizzy himself gave himself a clown nose. Yep. yep. So interesting. Yep. So. Let's get into this. Let's do this. Because I'm curious to see hey, what he did. Yeah. Look at me. Yeah. You're not even ready. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking Liz over here. No <laughs> headphones on and shit. I, I was a little excited, okay? I wanted to she, like. She's just ready for Grizzy to come through. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm just curious. Now, I'm really curious to see how Grizzy. No, for real, for real. How he if he if he really goes at M, or if he's talking about the things around M. Yes, exactly around. <laughs> That's what. That's the concept I'm seeing. Yeah. Here. So let's see. Yeah. If I was Eminem, pick a pick and slim shady. Why would I drop a diss on these rappers just trying to bait me? On second thought, I would just lose it and go crazy. Probably hit the booth, then call the doctor to come and make me a beat. Someone saying that game. Oh, damn, great. Okay. 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 So All I right. like that. If I was Eminem, why would I drop a diss on any of these clowns? Because you're making them big. I, I, I like that. Yeah. All right, Grizzy. On a second thought, no, nah, I'm just going to go in the booth and I can just spaz because I can. Because he probably has. And that's probably what M does. Dude. M probably gets pissed off and goes and disses people. You know how many disses this guy probably has on Yeah, it's a, that's his therapy. That's, yeah, his, <laughs> that's his outlet to get. And he probably goes back and listens to them. Like, they don't want me to release this. Yeah, you know, <laughs> it, the disrespect too much. They can't handle Ooh, that. Oh, I forgot I said that. <laughs> how many of those things have, do you think Dre's listened to and been like, damn, I want to put this to a beat? <laughs> <laughs> but man, but, it's the battle this would bring. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. No. <laughs> <laughs> right, I, 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 oh. so, I like where Grizzy's got, how he's doing this. No, so, for real. I think I know where he's going with this. I think I get what he's doing with this. And I think when we've seen the thing, I, I remember him. I think he said kind of like he was doing it from this, but I wanted to hear it first. Mm. Doing, I think he said M's, he's writing from M's persona in this. Okay. All right. I wanted to see how he did it and how he brought it up. Yeah. But that's just. I be hit like the booth, it. then call the doctor to come and make me a beat. Someone saying that gang gon' have to thank me for reviving his whole career. It's been dead lately. Go ahead, mention Haley and see if this AK won't turn your brain into mashed potatoes. Mine is the gravy. Trust it's no biggie. Keep it a buck fifty, I know. Nowadays everybody this is slim like they got something to say, but nothing comes out when they move their lips. Just some clout for clicks. Goddamn, the stand. I've heard what? the forgot about yeah. Dre scheme, man. Yeah. Uh -huh. I heard that. that was, the way you say yeah. that, too. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's dropping this is on M because they're trying to blow themselves up. Oh, they're trying yeah, to yeah. use this man's name to get us up there. But Grizzy's showing respect with this. Mm -hmm. This isn't a diss. Nah. This isn't a diss. Nah. The How title's just, I think the title's more click. It is good people. Yeah. How many people unsub from Grizzy's channel because of this song? Do you think? Um, the ones who don't actually listen to music, they just skim through it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. How many messages do you think Grizzy got? How dare you go on <sighs> Eminem? How would you even consider it? Three. First of all, listen to the listen to the track. Yep. You know how many people, and that's just in music, but like in uh, articles and stuff, they they go by um the headlines. Yep. And don't read the and substance. do not read because mm. the, yeah, exactly because it's, sometimes it's totally different for what the headline says. Yeah. What, do you, what do you think the uh, saying? Judge a book by its cover, or don't judge a book by its cover. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. 
Because you could look at the cover of anything and be like, damn, that looks like and people trash. still yeah. And people know that saying, they, they still do it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Of it's course. Crazy. Because it's so easy to judge based off of that first impression. Pressure, exactly. yeah. Because even before, like a week ago, when we first heard, oh, shit, Drizzy's is going to drop a diss on him. Yeah. It, uh, what come, what first comes to your mind, like, it's yeah. like. Uh, I feel about it. That's one of my favorite. But, eh, let's see what this let's is see what I, Yeah, let's yeah. see what Exactly. Again, it's the same thing with game. It's like, I don't think it's a good idea. Well, let me see what this guy got to say, though. Mm-hmm. Hey, I'm open for diss tracks. Hey, it might be the diss track of diss tracks. It ain't going to be. But it might be. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't going to be. <laughs> No. Hey, I'm ready for diss tracks. But, but you see, you got to listen to the record first. Grizzy said that in his live yeah. before everything started going up crazy with No Life Shack, which we'll address that in, after too. But Jeez. You got to listen to the record. If you're gonna judge the record, listen to the record. And we're just starting to listen to. Yeah. The but R can already tell he's showing love to Eminem. Yeah. This this isn't a diss to Eminem. Think the only one on M's dick. Oh, you forgot about Dre, the one who made me the sickest lyricist in syphilis, desensitive MCs. I done raised with my penmanship. Ooh, I'm so sick of them. Look at him using my name for clickbait. They hate my white privilege in hip hop. Cause I done. That's his writing as M there. Yeah. 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 Yep. He's writing as if he is Eminem. So the Eminem diss is him writing as Eminem, dissing the world around him. Okay. So it is the Eminem diss because he's Eminem dissing. Yes. Okay. Mm-hmm. I like it. I got. I see yeah. it. I, I see yeah. it. I like. You know. I, I love see that it. I approach. see the concept. Who's ever done an approach like that before? To rap from another person's perspective, perspective. but to be dissing. But your, to be dissing. That's hard to do. Yeah. That's like an insight within the insight. He got something over here. Yeah, that's, that's he different. He really does. Uh-huh. That's different. I like the approach that Grizzy's doing. Yeah, that's different. This is awesome, Grizzy. Made so much dividends. That's why they jumping on my dick. It's indicative. And come to think of it, my best friends are in on this. Royce the five nine been using my name and spinning this narrative. While my fans just laughing, I'm so sad for him. I feel bad for him. All them times I went to bed for him, but I can't react because I'm not black and he's activists. Keep bringing up my race and I can't challenge it. If I was him and them, I would sign a Grizzly character slash rapper to stop from harassing me with them raps he does. If I was him and them, her black slim shady, I'd expose the game and try the whole rap game. Crazy. Ha, ha, uh-huh. my name is- okay. If Eminem really wanted to, and let, let's be fair, <laughs> if he really, really wanted to, he and, could expose everything. Yeah, Eminem could expose a lot of people, man. If M really got pissed off to the point he could burn the entire M music industry to the ground, you know why he doesn't? No, I'm mean, honestly asking, why do you think he doesn't? I have my opinion, but I'm curious to what you think. Why? Why would M not want to burn it all to the ground? Well, to be honest, I think it'd be unfair to the, a lot of other artists. Exactly. Who actually are who actually work for it and are authentic in what they do. Exactly. He'd be ruining it for sense, for. Yeah. He'd be ruining it for his peers and for his peers and the upcomers. Hundred percent, my respects. opinion. Actually, what I was gonna say. Yeah, he'd be ruining it for him. See, Ian and I are always like most of the time. Hey. Like, when it comes hey. to music, we're right there. Hey. But yeah, <laughs> Eminem could destroy the whole industry if he wanted to. Yeah, he just chooses not to. That's a lot of power right there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And everyone and people are like, there's one guy couldn't take down the entire He's the biggest rapper in the world. The connections that he's got. The rap the rap name Eminem, it's it's the biggest. He's he's just the biggest rapper. Cause, Cause let's be real. What this big as Eminem is, if anybody that had any gonna live on actual and on. information that M had and did on. anything derogatory. Anything. Outside of what we already know between the abuse and everything else that he went through and he's admitted to. If they actually, if they had anything on him, stealing taxes or something, <laughs> anything, stealing. you think somebody would not have written something and used it to take this man to task? I see what you mean by that. With the amount of weight that is behind him and the amount of, if you actually had true information that could attack Eminem, why would it not have been done already? He's the biggest name. That's true. Now, the game better have something like yeah, that. Game, you, <laughs> you better have something that nobody's ever known about him. Yeah, yes, yeah, so factual. And I don't want to hear shit about him just something being the white you rapper. Can't just... You better be playing some video or some sound of him saying the N-word over and over again or something yeah. inside your song. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, 
and even then, I, I honestly think that there was a video servicing of him going around, going back and forth with Roy saying the N-word, just playing with it. People would be like, well, he's from Detroit. <laughs> honestly, it'd be like, he invited us to the cookout. So. Yeah. Like... I mean, how how many people, oh, well, there'd be a lot of people fake mad at him doing that. Cause it, but in a, I'm talking about in a friend way, not mm. disparaging way. You know how people in the... Who know each other, grow up and talk. Nah, I mean, if, him, it, if there it, was a video of him do, and Royce, it started, does happen. And just they thought they were being private and they were just being bros. It does happen. I know. Oh, people would try to people would paint it, paint it as something. That's exactly it. But I'm saying it does happen. That, that's my point. It would be completely blown and spun out of proportion. Huh. But if there is, I mean, you better have proof of him like drowning kittens in a street. <laughs> Jesus, <Christ. laughs> I mean, something. Oh my god, Jesus! Because what has M actually ever done musically? I'm not talking about his record. Everybody knows about his freaking record. Okay, that that's been dragged through for that years. That would hurt my heart. Yeah, I know. If I know. they find something like that, yeah. But but you know what I mean. What Same. actually has he done? I just know the man minds his business. Exactly. Mm-hmm. And gives flowers to the ones that he believes are better than him. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. And if M sees something in you, if he thinks that he, you have a shot, he's going to try and help you. If you prove to him that you are you're worth, legit. Yeah, you're mm-hmm. worth it, yeah. That's what, yeah. That's... And people don't like that. Well, why do you got to prove to him? Because <laughs> you don't just let anybody randomly walk off the street and into your studio. Exactly. You need to show evidence that you... Could. And the sad part was, if Eminem himself actually listened to Grizzy, he'd probably want to go meet this dude. Yeah, I doubt Grizzly, I doubt Grizzly Eminem's don't... people have ever let him listen to it because they've only told him that Grizzy's a guy that disses you for clout. That's probably what he's been told. Probably. Oh, this is just some dude dissing you. Don't even bother listening to it. And M probably has so many things going on. He's yeah, not going to go out of his way to listen to some random... And for him, some random rapper. Because to, to, to Eminem, Grizzy is just some random rapper. Yeah, because that, that status. Y- 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 you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. It's not, it's not, that's not disparaging to Grizzy at all. Because he is just some yeah. other rapper. Yeah. He's a lot better than most of the people on YouTube and stuff. Oh, definitely. He's one of the better lyricists on YouTube. Yeah. He's one of my favorites up there. should be way bigger than he is. Oh, you should be way bigger. It's the fact that Grizzy's so outspoken and does stuff like this. Yeah. But he's a he is a real real one. Yeah, I mean, like he said, he doesn't care if he if he had people unsubscribe him. Yeah. Now listen to the record. I mean, we're only a minute thirty three in, and For I real. like what and I've, I, I like what he does. Yeah. I, I remember him saying what he said. I'm not gonna sit there and make, oh my god, he figured this out. No, no, no. I remember him saying it in the live. I was just playing along during the beginning to get because Ian hadn't seen it at all. I didn't hear the song. No, I haven't heard the song. No, me either. I remember him talking about it in the live before all that new No, no Life Shaft said. He said something about doing it from Eminem's uh, perspective. Pers- yeah. yeah. So, I'm glad that he did that. And I wanted to see how he did it. And I'm loving how he's doing it. I mean, yeah, I got no complaints. So, see what else. I will make the whole world hang. This is not that usual. Say we get slow. You heard me fall. This dad has a no below P. Crip shit. D. R. E. Was the main list. Yeah. If I was him and then I'd probably sign some new talent Murder a mumble rap who's guns clapping and trapping And drug trafficking cracked about blood diamonds in Africa If I was him and them, I would go back to that backpack and savage on boom bat battle rapping like smacking him Holy sheep, I just happen to be the catalyst For every YouTube reacting, I'm really passionate About Marshall Mathers, but Panner and so is Asti Kiss Ain't that a bitch they- About every reactor not catching this <laughs> Dude, it's hard to catch bars sometimes, yeah. man. And I'm sure we'll be the first ones to admit we don't. Oh, catch I don't. Every I bar. don't catch every bar on the first time. I don't. But that's the be- that's the beauty of it. When yeah. we go back and listen to it, it's like, oh my god, that's what he was yeah. doing. Yeah. Oh, when you hear, that's what he was trying to talk about. Let me go back and listen. To- oh shit, it's, that's what. It, it takes time. Sometimes it takes time. You really got to dive into a record. Some people are very good at catching the very first time. Yeah. A lot of people pre-watch the video and be like, oh, I can catch that bar. Let me go. Here we go. That happens a lot with reactors too. We, yeah. uh, but that, that's not us. That's a, nah. a, not us. I like how raw this track sounds. Mm-hmm. But th- I like how raw Grizzy usually sounds yeah. when he's doing that. 
again, a guy that actually is a real lyricist, doing it for the people. Thank God he's not trying to care about the music industry doing that. Because if 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 Rizzy actually cared about being big, he could he, he could yeah. he could have played the game. Yeah, done what he needed to do. Yeah, been not fake worth it. Shit. Not worth it. Don't sell your shit. <clears throat> He mm-hmm. could he could have went the screw route if he wanted to. Nah, nah, nah. I have way more respect Gotta for Grizzly. Gotta keep Grizzy. it real. Gotta keep it real. Independent is the way. Yeah, it is. I have the utmost respect for Grizzly because mm. he's doing it legitly and he's trying to build a community. He's trying to build people who love his music. Respect. He don't care about all the other uh, noise. All the yeah. He wants people who want to be here for his music because that's the way it should be. I let. The, you can't make your favorite artist be something that you want them to Vito, be. Vito, preach it. Preach it. They are always what brought you to them. Yeah, preach it, Vito. People are stupid. Get on their knees like Colin Kaepernick yeah. and start slurping them in the mall fest. If he asked for this, but let me ask you this. If your channel got no traction, would you backtrack to stop that cap? I still react to him. If I was him and him, I would drop a surprise album Ooh. the same day as the game. If your numbers were due, would you go back and react to him? <clears throat> Even if you didn't like it, uh, pretty much saying, even if you didn't like me, just because your numbers, now you go back and react to me, all of a sudden your numbers are blowing. I just caught that quick bar, what he was about to say. If I was Eminem, I would drop my a surprise album the same, same day, day game hasn't... drops the yep, disc. Yep, yep, honestly, yep. Yeah. Honestly, I would yeah. do it. <laughs> yep. That's exactly yep. what I yep. would do Dude. if I was Eminem. Yep. Dude, Dude imagine he drops a disc, uh, Matt, and Eminem just says, album. all right. I'm gonna just drop the album today, you know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Damn. Uh, and it, the album's called <laughs> "The Real Game." <laughs> <laughs> how oh, how funny would that be if he if he drops an album called "The Game"? <laughs> <laughs> that would destroy the game. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cap, I still react to him. If I was him and him, I would drop a surprise album the same day as the game and this MGK after him. The buy Joe Buttons podcast to get back at him. The peanut gallery keeps chattering. Did I f- then buy Joe, Joe Buttons, Buttons podcast, podcast to get back you know, at him? You know, you know, M got the money to do it. Yeah. If ever. Easily. He got the money to buy Buttons podcast. He is forever bro. rich, I swear. <laughs> He's got more money than he could ever know what to do with. Yeah. yeah. If M wanted to do a lot of things, he could. Yeah. I mean, you can't get mad at him for not wanting to do certain things. He Everything he does is all about music. music. Yeah, that's his mm-hmm. passion. Right. He he's worked, not a philanthropist. He worked hard for that. He's Come not a on. human resource. He's nah, not out nah. there trying to be. His, his passion is music. He's yeah. not going to go plant trees outside of St. Louis like Mr. Beast. <laughs> what the <laughs> that's not that's not Eminem. Nah, we, we, just... Everybody loves Eminem or hates Eminem <coughs> because of the music. Yeah, mm-hmm. not what he does or how he does things for people. Not, not because he's saving go. people's lives, he's even though sometimes gonna, with the music you do. He's not gonna go plant trees. <laughs> <laughs> he's not out there arresting people. That's not why Eminem. Oh my! It's because God. of the music and the way he writes his raps. Hey man, he just puts everything on the table too. Yeah. He he got nothing to hide. Hey man, respect. Which That's is it. why I respect Grizzy. Mm-hmm. He, I mean, he's no Eminem. Grizzy, I you're know. not yeah, Eminem. Yeah. Eminem. But Grizzy doesn't give two shits. No, he just does what he does. Grizzy's his own thing. Grizzy doesn't want to be Eminem. He wants to be Grizzy. Yeah, exactly. Facts. Mm-hmm. Grizzy, M- it said it. Eminem has inspired him, but Grizzy wants to leave the, Grizzy's legacy. Yeah. Don't be a clone. Exactly. <clears throat> yeah. Be real. Hey man, you whispered it, so I figured I'd whisper it too. Yes. But again, if guys do it for as long as Eminem, who knows? Dude, man? respect the longevity, man. And just because somebody doesn't get as famous as Eminem doesn't mean they don't have a pen as strong as Eminem. That's true. That's true. Look at Lupe. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we were we were sleep. <laughs> we we Dude, were sleep, man. Might be one of the guys closest we've seen to Eminem in a long time. J Cole. Yeah. I'm really really like. J Cole's him. getting better. Yeah, but J. I'm, I'm, I'm yeah, really he's not there yet. Yeah, he's not I'm up really, there yet. He's not. He's, really, he's really one really of the like goats him. already. Yeah. Yeah. J Cole, but he's, he's not, not at M's, M's level. He's, yet. he's not at M's level. Oh, no, no, yet. Not yet. No, no. But but there's Tech Nine. Tech Nine. Oh, Tech Nine. Tech's there. Yes. Yes, I like Tech Nine. You see, we can sit here and say things like that. Yeah. Because we're fans. We don't have. We're not. Gospel and anything. These are no. our opinions. Exactly. Yeah, you can disagree with us all you want. So we, I can't me. believe you said that. Calm it down. 
Inhale, it's exhale. Mm-hmm. In, inhale, We're exhale. all not going to like the same thing. Yeah. No. <laughs> at least reasons we don't, and, why and, we like it. And at least you're not going to sit here and say we've liked every single Eminem song ever. No. no oh, God, there's, no. There's songs that I like more than others. Exactly. Song, some ones I just don't vibe with. Yeah, it's... Anybody that it's sits like, there and that says that song is not for me, they like one hundred percent of somebody's catalog. They're bullshitting. Yeah, <clears throat> they're bullshitting. Factoring not too many collapse with his rap guy vernacular. We all use them for views, and it's blasphemy. If I was him and them, her black slim shady, I'd expose the game and drive the whole rap game crazy. My name is. If I was him, I would make the whole world hate. This is not that usual. Say we get slow. You heard me. Yeah, who you know can tackle this topic the way I tackled it? Not even Tom McDonald. That nigga's just whacking shit. If I was in. Oh! Ooh. Oh! Oh, I did not. Damn. I, I feel like the chain hit me. <laughs> he, didn't, he didn't like Tommy Mac. Oh. He said that dude is whack. And now, I, I need to find Honestly, out why he doesn't like Tom now. Well, it, it, it's the reasons a lot of people like like Tom. That's but, a tough comparison, man. But to be fair, honestly, it might be in the same lines of like Adam Calhoun. Grizzy, you should feel that way about Mac. And honestly, you might be 100% right. Have a conversation with him. Just like Calhoun did. Scream oh, yeah. at each other. Yep. Get it out. Yeah. It's just like you Ow. said. And honestly, Grizzy, even if you don't watch it, it's like Grizzy said. Listen to the record. Before you make a judgment, why don't you talk to the man before you make assumptions about him? Who knows? He could have. He could have possibly already had. He might have already. Exactly. exactly. But if he, he didn't, did I'm just saying this because we don't know if he has. Because I don't. Exactly. Know if he just nonchalantly exactly. said that shit though. <laughs> but again, yeah. he said that with his whole chest though. He did. I ain't taking sides right now. I'm just. But again, I'm just saying. I mean, I mean, I don't like everything Tom and McDonald did. Listen, did I'd be interested in a little gri- grizzly time back and forth. I'd be, I, I'd tune in. You mm-hmm. see, I'd rather them be together on a song. Yeah. I, I do. But I, I, I understand the that. The battle but would be hilarious. Sometimes I just want to see two rappers be, be like, all right, you two, you two stay in there and rap. Or you two, you two make, make two tracks. I want to see who got the better pen. See, that would be fun. But you can still do the same thing with them rapping together. Mm-hmm. That's true. That's yeah. true. Fair. Because even with Tommy Mac and Calhoun, you can see where McDonald's been outshining Calhoun and where Calhoun kind of comes up. Yeah, that's fair. You see, you see what I mean? I can, I can agree with you on that one. Because when you're building each other up, you get the best out of each other. Yeah. yeah. And they both have different styles, too. So, Sometimes you get the worst out of people when you're battling. So, well, right here in this, Grizzly don't like Tom. No. <laughs> <So> <laughs> that, that's very clear. Yeah. That's yeah. very clear. But, again, I'd like to think, I'd like mm. to, and honestly, Grizzly, have a conversation with Tom McDonald and record it. Yeah, ma- yeah, maybe. Yeah. Honestly. Topic the way I tackled it, not even Tom McDonald. That nigga's just whacking shit. If I was him, I would take that dear slim track, throw it in the trash, then tell his fans yeah. stop gassing him. Join the Lucas, even use him. Then retracted it. Glad use him for clicks. Got a back from that. Less than practical, cause deep down half of you probably wouldn't know my name, but I ain't mad at you. What you think, no life shack? Is that laughable? It's all the act all thought out. Ooh, that was an old Shaq. Yeah, he's honestly he's right. Shaq's theatrical. Can't be hating on him for building himself up, but he stole everything. You know, I, I'm still not. Can't hate the that. hustle because you, you you earned everything you got. Congratulations, Shaq. Good for you. Still, but man, you got it. It's on. dirty. You did it dirty. I'd rather it's get way there. too dirty, dude. I'd rather get there being me, not somebody else. Well, this is an interesting track. Because you know, because <laughs> when when you're being fake, you know you're gonna slip, and people are gonna see the slip ups, yeah. and that's how that's how they know that you're fake. That's when like you're being real, catfish people. you you can't you can't find nothing on them. Don't, don't you know what I'm real? saying? If that pissed off Shaq, that really wasn't that bad. He said he wasn't even mad at him. Yeah, I wasn't he even. He was just really. saying he's, he is fake though. Damn. And again, that was, Damn. that's just a little love tap because he was annoyed because he didn't promote the track. He promised him. Honestly, dude, if you just if you're gonna say if you say you're gonna do something, just do it. Dude, if you say you're gonna do something, then you leave me hanging with one of the it, most the you, biggest independent artists. And of then all you time. just ghost the person. 
Not even say anything. After not you even, told me you're going to do it? And not even give a reason? Yeah, that's a little... Come on, you got to be man enough to give that's a reason why you couldn't do it. How would you feel if you had just done a track with one of your biggest idols? You had No Life Shack tell you who's going to do the, the thing. Guarantees he's going to drop the promo the day before Ghost You. How would you be feeling? I'd feel some type of way about that. Because you got left hanging in front of Tech after you told Tech. Yeah. I got the promo covered. He didn't give no response either, right? The reason nope. why? Just ghosted him. They ghosted him, see? Just making sure that. Just tell him, yeah. bro, I can't do it. I couldn't get the recording done. Simple as that. Just be man about it. Be honest. Yeah, that's that's, that's all. Said, yeah. well, what what are you going to lose with that? Like, that's Grizzly probably would have had more respect. That I'm, I'm, exactly. like he said that in the live. Too. I would have had more respect if he would have told me I couldn't do it. Why ghost me? I can understand that. Then you got tech feeling a certain way. You make me look a certain way in front of tech. Tech, yeah. Damn. Damn. Damn, shit's tough, man. Shit's tough. It's mm. it's amazing that Grizzly's the only one of the only ones that doesn't really mess with anybody from YouTube. You can see why. <clears throat> How fake people are behind the scenes. It, this whole shit is it's shady people live in the world, man. And again, Grizz, you're close to us. I'd love to sit down and talk with you. That, that would be an awesome yeah, episode that'd be cool. conversation. That'd be cool. The moving lateral. So we gotta battle you and stroll down this avenue. Knowing the stands gonna be mad. It's all tactical. If I was him and then I'll probably diss me too. It's the stands like me who helps this ring through. Cause we put them on a pedestal overlooking incredible, credible legends. That's why some don't have respect for you. I ain't saying it's slim for it. When rappers like Rick Ross, they get on who been for really deserve this songs. And Jay's first on Renegade was the most slept on. And I'm just getting ticked off. All these rappers on TikTok who tiptoe around the fact that your last shit so only cause your brain and goddamn is sinful. Plus I got banned from Sway. They thought I ditched you. The concept was simple. But because of info, artists like me get blackballed and sent to the gulag when you are. Yeah. Okay, Grizzly, calm the Grizzly. Yeah, Grizzly, I know. Grizzly mad now. Yeah, yeah. Because, he was getting angry in there. Because people told M that he that some random guy is just dissing you for clout. And, so, he, and, so that's M not... and he got blackballed. M probably never listened to any of Grizzly's music. Honestly, he probably just heard some stuff from his boys. He's like, oh, screw this guy. Just using my name for clout. Just like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. mm. Probably never even listened to Wear Shady. Because it was never, nowhere near a diss. Damn, did you hear the anger in yeah, Grizzly's voice the, just now? Yeah, because he got blackballed and screwed over from yeah. going on shows like Sway and everything else. Because somebody else was in M's ear telling him how what Grizzy was is, and honestly that's not really M's fault because he, he's got a lot going on yeah. not, he's not, again he's not going to go out of his way to go right. listen to some random person he has a life <laughs> come on yeah he mostly probably he only listens life. to stuff when it's handed to him from someone he trusts <clears throat> you know what I mean true yeah so that's fair. if somebody he trusts didn't hand him something to listen to he's not going to listen to it because he considers it a waste of his time probably hmm just Man. think about being in his position. You know, you know, and you know got a I mean? schedule. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm sure he browses through YouTube and stuff and watches random stuff. The chances of him going out of his way and landing on a Grizzly Hendrix video. It's rare. Yeah. Rare, but not impossible. Yeah. The dude's got so much going on. The, the, yeah. For him to go out of his way to look at random. And I'm sure he might have a thing where he just goes through and tries to find random people to see what they do. <clears throat> I don't know. But the chances are slim. Ha! <laughs> I ha, Vito! <laughs> this is so slim. I like that. <laughs> Pump a cup to info, artists like me get blackballed and sent to the gulag when you are the main reason I'm too raw. Who you think I learned this from? Slim these new guys now. Mm. So it's not really a diss, it's pretty much a, it's, it's a plea to us. Yeah. Like, dude, I never dissed you. He's mad because, he, well, it's not, but dude, and even still, Grizzly, it's not Eminem himself. That has blackballed and kept you down. It's the, be it's it's the, the people, people around, around him. him. Yeah. It's which still sucks. But again, it's a lot of it's the people that are around all these major artists. That, again, which sometimes when they actually listen to something, they're like, "Who? What the hell were you guys talking about? Let me talk to this dude." I bet you'd be different. Mm. Mm. But again, that's why when Eminem finally does hear somebody and gets them in the room with them, he kicks everybody else out. He did that to Kendrick. 
<laughs> he did it to Joyner. He did it to yeah, everybody. Like, dude, he does that for a reason. You got to make sure that you can rap. But so, but if, to be honest, to be to, to honestly be mad at Eminem for doing anything to you would have to be after you've been in the room with him. Mm. You know what I mean? If Let's you've been that. in that one-on-one situation with Eminem, and then all of a sudden you get blackballed and stuff, dude, what the hell did you do? <laughs> yeah, yeah, but she, but she, she, come on now. Were you, were you fake in front of Eminem? Yeah. Stupid dumbass? Of course you're going to get blackballed at that point. Yeah. Not saying Grizzly's dumbass. That's not what I said. I was being facetious. <laughs> you're an, an example. Exactly. Yeah, there you go. People an take that. Oh, my God. He's saying Grizzly. <laughs> You know how people are on the internet, man. Sensitive. You know they, uh-huh, uh-huh. So sensitive. But I, I, got- I still like how Grizzly, what he did. Yeah. Writing from Eminem. Now he's switching to his perspective about. Yeah. His perspective about everything. If he was Eminem. Yeah. <clears throat> But some of the consequences and move on Fell in love with rap Cause you and my nigga Tupac Really I'm just dissing myself I want what you got mm-hmm. hey, Every rapper's dream is to have what Eminem has Yeah if I was him and them, hold a black slim shady, I'd expose the game and drive the whole rap game crazy. Hot, hot, my name is. If I was him, I would make the whole world hate. This is not that you shoot, will say we get slow. You heard me fall. This dead has a noble OP crib shit. D R E was the main list song. Now. Damn, Grizzly went in on this shit, man. I like what Grizzly did with that, though. I really like what he did with that. A lot of people probably got mad at him when they found out he was doing another yeah. this. Damn, bro. Damn. <clears throat> this is why you listen to the record. Yeah, you got to listen to the record. That's some... I actually like that. Yeah, no, I like it. That was, was good. actually a really good song. That was yeah, good. And the concept good. behind it was good, too. Mm-hmm. Respect, Grizzy. Much respect, Grizzy. Much see, respect. See, see, people, this is what happens when you actually listen instead of just skim and judge music. Exactly. But I vibe with it. I see the point he's trying to make. Too much clownery going on and everything. Yeah. Damn. But, dude, honestly, if you, can actually, if you, if you haven't yet, have a conversation with Tom if you can. Is a year of the Yeah, clowns. definitely. Scream at each other. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes you got to get it out. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> and then you might, ah! find, you might find out more in common than you realize. Yeah. Exactly. I mean, but then again... Work, you might really hate each other and find but, out it's even more But then again, again if that conversation is already happening, y'all just don't vibe, sometimes it happens. Yeah. Y'all just don't sometimes, vibe. Yeah, sometimes you don't vibe. But again, you don't have to agree on everything That's true. to understand. That's true. Maybe he knows something about Tom that we don't know. Yeah, it could be. Could, because we never know. Grizzly out here exposing shit. <laughs> I <laughs> left let, let, us, right. let us know because we, right. we don't want to be like listening to somebody that's you know shoot man shit's wild out here yep but guys I hope y'all enjoyed this one like comment subscribe blow us up y'all know what to do thanks for stopping and spending some time today hit that notification bell and give it a share because it does help the channel out please and thank you all and see you guys in the next one Tyler Lee Speaks oh <laughs> I've been speaking <laughs> later y'all later everyone